All right. Hey guys, what's up? It's a wolf here. One know me. How all my adventures doing? Welcome back to some more Gravitation Memories. So we are getting ready to do Black Flame Ruin. I already tested, well, limit tested. It, it's fine. <laughs> Not the greatest thing ever for right now, for now. But I did get my level 70 gear. Well, technically level 75 gear. All done. I will have to make my level 80 gear, which is not going to be fun because that is combat combat gear. And I hate making that gear. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you. I hate making combat gear. It is uh, tedious to build. I say, don't get me wrong. It's good. It's good gear to build. Especially if you can get the legendary done. It is just tedious to get all the resources for it. So that's going to be quite the um, fun event to do. But there is one last thing that I want to do before I even start getting into that dungeon, which is. What is it? I could turn this on now. Oh, apparently this person's outside. Oh, I didn't get the quest anyway. Okay, good. <laughs> it's a good thing that I didn't uh, go through that quest. Okay, so moon face. Okay. So first thing I want to do is go down to the island and try and get the chain quest done. Let's see. What was it? Grand Fantasia. I have to sneeze. Oh my god. I have this annoying. Freaking dang it. Uh, anywho. As you can see, I got my uh, potions for the reputation because I was farming reputation during the weekend. And we are nearly maxed with all of them. I still find it funny that none of these stat, none of these titles have stats to them. That's the thing that threw me off towards a lot of these because you have to do a lot of crap just for them and they have no stats to them. I wish there was a way. If you could not, sir, stop. Stop doing what you're doing. But I wish there was a way to have like a presented title and, you know, a normal title. Well, the title for the stats and one for showing. I wish uh, the pro well, the main server would have done that. But they didn't. So I have these to fill out. Um, the quest I am looking for now is... Sir, if you could fuck off, mate. Where are the items? Oh, there they are. It's for ancient jewelry. That's, that's what it was. Ancient jewelry. I'm curious if they just changed it to where it just shows up. And it's just a normal repeat quest. Or do I actually have to do the chain quest still? Where was this at? <sighs> You're becoming a nuisance, you know that, right? Okay, twin. There it is. Then it is you. Ah, well, no. You. So I'm curious. This is it just straight up done? I can just do it? Ah, it is. Okay, so I don't have to go through the chain quest for this. The reason I want to do this is because it gives me... Hold on. Let me lower my... Wait, is that it? No, that's it. Because it gives me four C's trading cancel points. And those are for the foods. So that will give me buffs. More buffs that I can use. So we're going to be here for just a little bit and doing this. 
Oh yeah, this gives a lot of uh, XP, doesn't it? Well, I don't think it's a lot of XP, was it? Nah, it's not a lot of XP. I think I was almost done, like, leveling anyway. It does give me quite a bit of gold, though. In return. But it's like 15. The rest of the... Um, The rest of these only cost 5. This one costs 15, so 2. So you'll take up 2. Hmm. I forgot what's the max I need for all the food. Because I've I've been selling a lot of things. My skills are all up to date now, finally. So I don't have to worry about that anymore. Now I've just been upgrading gear. That That's all I've been doing and focusing on. And thankfully, that is out of the way for now until level 80. Then once level 80 starts, then I have to go do that fun. I'm really not looking forward to making this yellow gear because I'm pretty sure it's it's only from a mutated dungeon. And I'm pretty sure I know which mutated dungeon is from, which is not going to be fun. This is the annoying part. It's the fragments. Um, let's see. Where are these from again? Let's make sure I'm thinking about the right thing. Database. GF database is the best place to get information from. Mutated Phoenix Tower. I figured as much. I figured as much as Mutated Phoenix Tower. Not looking forward to that shit. This is gonna be fucking annoying because they're level 82. They're all level 80. I say on top of that being level 80... My hammer is also going to be, my 85 hammer is going to be annoying to get a hand on as well. The orange version of it is actually still pretty good. Unless they nerfed it. Or made it weaker somewhere. Okay, so where are we at with this? Actually, that's a pretty decent amount so far. Just for having that many. I want to touch 1600. So if I... If there's a good pal of these necklaces in there, I will grab them. I'm happy that they just got rid of the chain quests. The chain quests were very, very annoying. Especially just for this and for this quest to disappear at a certain, like, wasn't didn't it disappear at, like, a certain level? You couldn't use it anymore. I think it was, like, level 66. Like, I don't think the... Official server devs realize how annoying reputation is to get. Uh, anything in here that I can get or that I need? 
Level 80. Shit. Can't grab that. Tree in here yet? Nope. No tree of lives. Okay, now there's not a lot that's slightly overpriced, but fuck it. I was about to say, there was some graphics messed up uh, during the first launch. Well, the first maintenance today. Which threw me off because this got changed back to his normal color. The um, enhanced stones had like weird images. I was just sitting here like, oh, what, what went on here? Did something break? This is not anything completely game breaking. Okay, so we have these now. Now I can go all the way back to Kazlau and see if... See if I can get all the foods that are there or if I need it to be higher. The Thor. Um, no, not you. Down. That's not it. Oh, yeah, it's this place. I forget what which one this is. Hmm. I'm not remember which one that was, but My curiosity is, I figured as much, so you can only have one active, noted. This would be the best one for me, if I could buy it. Kind of funny that there's no strength. I also got rid of my uh, vitality uh, nucleus because they do not give vitality at all. Unless they finally fixed it. I just completely stopped using them just because they don't give anything. Which one is this? Remove this. Say no increase or anything. Even though it says it's supposed to be giving you like a certain amount, it's supposed to give you like ten percent. Maybe that's the old effect, and they just removed it from all nucleus, and nucleus are just movement speed now. Oh, they changed what these look like. That's what it is. This just confused the hell out of me. Because I was sitting here and I was like, wait a minute, what is that? So they're slowly changing images over over time. Ah, okay, so that's what that one looks like. Okay. So with that done... We head back. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh god, this still exists. Graphic bugs. Okay, it's fixed. <laughs> that just comes with your invitation. Don't worry about it. Uh, let's see. So, we did get a lot of boxes too.
I normally do the um, tables for XP. We'll say this, dude. This this one's fucking awful. <laughs> Except for the evasion one. That one's actually pretty decent. I'm still trying to figure out. Is this... Is this on attack or when your HP reaches that threshold? You get a chance. I never used that just because it was kind of like iffy on its explanations. I don't know. Anyway. Uh, they did fix uh, Anubis, female Anubis, uh, long animations. If I remember correctly, I cannot do my combo here. Because some enemies are immune to stuns, if I remember correctly. Finally got full attack. But I would like to have defense stance instead. Go oh, mental guard is actually half bad too. Because if I remember correctly, mental guard goes up into like 60, 60, no, 600 or 700. I think 700. Precise attack is also good as well. Full evasion or battle will is what I would take from this line. And I would take wolf form. Bloodthirsty. Out of all that. Just because bloodthirsty and uh Bloodthirsty gives a lot of damage to your first and what was it? Second seal, right? Yeah, draw madness and wait a minute. Wow, tear. Isn't that the lower form of what, like one of these moves? I just gotta remember because no, that's not it. So Letha wouldn't benefit from it. No, it's not rendering. Wait a minute. Am I blind? Wild tear. Oh, it was just towards... Okay. I was sitting here like, wait a minute, I've heard a wild tear before. So it's just all to the first skill. All of it's to the first skill. Okay, I was just sitting here and I was like, excuse me? Uh, others. Looks nice when you can play as her. Dang, did these run out as soon as I got up? I guarantee you if I talk to her, they're going to attack me. Ooh, nope. Rock Sprite. Uh, 
کند است بس. Okay, no, I can't still do it here. Okay, so you can still... So they changed it to where animations don't count for skills. So I can actually do this and just chill. If anything... Let's say, which one am I using? Oh, I didn't get the magic defense. This is the safer way of doing this. up all my buffs while I'm at it. Oh damn, that one ran out. Hold on. Where is it? Okay, I was about to say, I could have sworn I put this on. There we go. But yeah, got a lot of po got my hands on a lot of potions. Not only like very significant, but you know, they work. <laughs> and I also ended up getting this skill too, Protective Blessing, which is actually great for like wolf moments. But it's a lot easier if I just do wolf form because it's a lot faster. A lot more unsafe, but faster. And I'm still doing the whole die and revive strat with the Nubas keeping them in combat. My job is pretty much to do as much damage as I can. While Nubas starts tanking. The only issue with me is that I have to do it at the right time. I still find it funny that they hit me as soon as I come back. Like I like I ended up hitting them or something. I kept the stun hammer because it actually has a good chance of proccing. Ain't they AoEs? They're so annoying. Okay. Hmm.
But if I had my level 85 hammer, dude, I'm just saying, dude. They wouldn't even be getting this close. I was thinking about having both hammers, but I was like, no, the stun is too good to take off. It saves me from a lot of damage. Slow and setting. Fuck it. And you're going to come in. Oh, that works too. Not if I use the wrong hammer. There we go. We got sanction as well. So that's up to date is along with everything else. The only thing I don't have is Tree of Life. And having to craft Tree of Life is very annoying. If it's still the same way it works. To where you need all of those uh items. Yeah, I believe Anubis is only for boss at this point. <laughs> God, I wish I had a star stronger wand right now. Well, not wrong wand, staff. Skill just does not want to proc at all, Jesus. You like rock anything? No? Okay. Fair enough. Damn, I was kind of hoping you would miss. Yeah, you can cancel that. Keep an eye on it. Eh, it's about the same damage, to be honest. That's why I... No, no, it's not. Can I even stun you? Yeah, I figured as much. I can't stun you. That's where this issue starts to come in.
about to say, dude, can I get my debuff off? And now I leave the ice cube here. Now, since ah oh, shit, but I, I keep doing icon. I don't know why. Now since we're at enemies that can't be stunned, it's better to have this out. Wish I could remove that debuff inside of Wolf Form. <laughs> Wish I could use a lot of skills while I'm inside of my other forms. <laughs> Not even a rework gave me that luxury. We only got like a few new skills that we can use in our other forms. One of them was like a heal. Oh well, yeah, it was uh, Nature, which gave us like 2% regen. If you could fucking not, mate. Thank you. What the fuck, Agra? That's the only stun we actually get on start off. <laughs> oh yeah, I can show you guys the BS. The most BS school I tell you guys never to go for. Puppet Dance. Um, puppet Dance, like I've said before, is terrible. As a druid, you never pick that up. Because it has downfalls to it. But if you know how to play around it, it's useful. But most of the time, it is a downfall ability, especially in a group of enemies like this that deal a lot of damage. The downfall of it is, since it started combat with that enemy, such as... Hold on. Let me do this. Let me hide. And I will show you guys what I mean. You lose XP and drops. If they kill the enemy or if this kills the enemy. Because you technically didn't start combat. Even though you enter combat with this. You can still do the same debuffs. The same effects. Still. But if the enemy kills it. You lose all of that. So the best thing is to fight alongside with it. But the sad part is, pay attention.
we're killing enemies and we're not getting XP because the tree. The tree, Puppet Dance initiated a combat, so we get no XP out of that. That is the sad downfall of Puppet Dance. That is why Druids never use it. You lose XP, drops, everything. And I can go back in here. And now I start gaining XP. Because I, I technically initi initiated the combat. Once I revived. Puppet Dance is god awful. I forgot. Um, I think the official version also replaced Puppet Dance with something else. They just completely removed it. Because that it was so neglected. Negatively, uh, negatively received. But they didn't give us a summon. Oh, I wish they would have gave us a summon instead. You know, that would have been great. I'm just saying, dude. Just saying. Opportunity to make it a summon. <laughs> Official devs. I'm not talking to the private server. Because I don't, I don't think they would be able to, to do stuff like that. But oh, speaking of the official server, apparently Drifter is getting reworked. That confused the hell out of me. What are you fighting? I have no idea what you're fighting. Come with me, psychopath. But yeah, I, I was not expecting Drifter to actually get a rework or mechanic <laughs> because they are they are basically brand new characters or brand new classes that actually threw me off guard. Are you going to fight that thing again? What are you trying to fight Anubis? Tell me. What is it that's pissing you off right now? It has to be something outside of the map. It definitely has to be something outside the map. Because I'm still locked in combat. Hmm. I have no idea what it could be. But I am definitely in combat with something. Like, I was wondering, I was like, did you aggro on? Are you going to fight me? Here's another thing you can do as well with uh, Puppet Dance that makes it slightly useful. Ah, damn. I was about to say, it's good as a pick out from bosses. But I forgot, the aggro range is actually like way, way higher now. stuns okay so let's get rid of Anubis because she's gonna just run straight in like I said Puppet Dance range is very terrible for these ah oh, okay Apparently it didn't do it that time. Last time I pulled this boss with that. 
Nope, that one just initiates combat. Okay. Weird. That's how I pulled with it. Oh, dear God. Yeah, you have, like, multiple minions. Alright, like I said, my job is to deal as much damage as I can to Moonface before I, like, die. Then all their aggro swaps to her. I come back. Oh, whoops. Wrong thing. Which one's the uh, which one's the false one? I mean, real one. Can't tell because the means have the same name. There was a false one in here. Well, there's two false ones in here, then I can't distinctly tell which one is which. Why are the names the same? And also, didn't they have summon over their head? Hmm. The first run... <coughs> oh, excuse me. The first run of this actually went off a lot smoother. But that was off screen. I think it's just better if I revive, because she's going to die anyway. Part of me don't think defense matters in this game. Well, in this server. Because I don't feel like I'm reducing jack shit. Uh, I guess we can try Gorilla Form. See how long that lasts. If I was to do Gorilla Form... I would more than likely bring the um, the other hammer. I've been collecting other staffs. I have the 85. I have the 80. I have the level 80 hammer. I mean, this is decent for Gorilla, but Gorilla wakes up people very easily. As I was thinking to myself, I'd probably bring this hammer, if anything. Huh, wait, which one was it? I'll say there was one to reduce all damage. Well, all incoming damage. I have to remember which which one that was. Oh, I know how to look it up. Duh, because database has, doesn't update their shit. 
so they don't update their combos or anything like that. The whole combo list. Um, okay, it was this. There we go. If anything, it would be better to use this. Since I can't use um, my healing here. Yeah, even that doesn't work. Yeah, defense doesn't mean shit. Either that or Gorilla Form's defense isn't, like, actually proccing. Wait, what the fuck? Did I not get out of Gorilla Form? So I can put on Gorilla Guard? Oh, that actually works on him. I'm actually sh surprised. Gonna put on a shield. That shield will save me from a little bit of damage. Give my potion some time to go back up. Is it not going? Okay, I was about to say, is it not going to heal me? Can we do a round two of that? As I said before, off tank druid isn't half bad. I guess. Wait, was my healing not up? Oh my god, I don't think the healing was up. Either that or it's like massively delayed. There we go. Get him again. But the item's on the ground, and I don't think I'm going to revive by then. Yeah, I'm not going to revive by then. That sucks. And if I leave, I think it disappears too. 
That's weird. I could have sworn the healing was going to go off, but it was just very delayed. Maybe 30% is way too low because it can be skipped. Maybe that's what's going to was going to like really start hoeing me. Okay, she's going to die. As soon as the item disappear, I'll probably just restart. Yeah. Restart. Okay, maybe. Yeah, I thought these had like separate type. No, they're the same. Whoops. Oh, I had. Uh, okay, I know what I did wrong. I had the other potions, then they ran out. Yeah. Okay. That explains it. Uh. I had the lower form of the blessed potions. Guess I went through them all. Like, very quickly. Makes sense. We were able to do that, though. It's just that I need to get rid of the extra minions. Those extra two minions were adding on extra damage. Ah, that's annoying. I'm going to keep on this one just because that's the less damage. This is normally what I do anyway. When it comes to high level content. Is I keep on this one. It doesn't activate often. Here though. Hmm. I say in the official server, it activates a lot more often. Also keeps you from getting stunned or dazed. A lot of play styles are going to have to change up. At least until... Well, I could wait. It's at 85. I can go out and do overworld missions. Okay, I was wondering, I was sitting here like, wait a minute. Oh yeah, because I have what you call it off. God, skill combos are fucking terrible. I forgot how terrible Druid skill combos were. Holy shit. Forgot how shitty they were. Like, it's crazy how much Druid's gear is focused towards, like, physical. Just, like, wolf form and gorilla form. But their talents are so magic health. So, so, like, magic health heavy. God, I forget how old Druid was so fucking awful when it came to talents. This is the main thing I don't miss about old Druid. Is his talents. I definitely don't miss that shit at all. Oh, and I could have changed titles too. That's also another thing.
God damn, you're doing a lot more damage than the last run. Did a gear break? Maybe it's just because of the stuns. That, that could also be it, too. I think I might just have to wait until like level 85 before I start soloing dungeons again. Because this could actually get like really stupid towards a point. Because I'm just wasting like valuable potions. Like I said, my talents are so awful. Hmm. I don't mind gearing up a little bit more and leveling. I say that's that's literally the point I wanted to see. Is like, what point can I do I stop? Okay, yeah, everybody's making those are definitely secondary accounts. Everybody does that in the official server. Now I gotta remember what level am I. So this would probably be the best place to go to next. Yep, 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 yep. Um, should probably get rid of a lot of stuff though. <laughs> I do have like a lot of uh, gear I gotta get rid of. So journey to level 85. Or at least 84, because I think the orange life still hammer is 84, if I remember correctly. I'm not near it yet. I'm still at 80. I just gotten lazy on getting this up there because it takes so much time for these sprites. Waiting a whole like 20 minutes. Like I said, it's better than uh, Grand Fantage. Well, uh, the official server because that would be like up to an hour. Oh, there it is. So it's all the way over there. I was hearing like I know there's a merchant on this map. I also got to get my talents up. My talents are still like one. I also need better accessories, actually. These are awful. Hmm. Hmm. I'm trying to remember how I did everything. Because it could definitely be repeated. It can definitely be beaten solo. But I say just all my right gear is late game. To do that. Because once I hit 81, the, the hardest part is going to be getting those last five levels. But say if, it, if this starts taking too long, I might go to the, uh, the next private server. Because I don't want this series to like, be extremely long. Unless I actually like come back to it to actually like you know keep going.
Yeah, I was wondering how much XP y'all got. Y'all gave uh, not too much. God damn it. I keep doing that same thing. I see a hammer right there and I keep trying to put it there. Just because it's the easiest thing to get to. Plus, they're still updating the game. That's also another thing. They're still doing, like, changes to each of the classes, getting everything, like, you know, going. So it's going to be some time, because, like I said, I'm pretty sure... Okay, stop this. I'm pretty sure it is a freshly made server. So it really depends on how this how this open area gives XP. Hopefully their over their overworld is uh very uh XP heavy. I don't think times five uh interacts with uh quests either. But up until this point, I was actually enjoying uh, Solomon Dungeons, though. Taking a challenge. But I'm just going to be wasting a whole bunch of resources if I keep trying to brute force them. Say rework? Jesus Christ, that's a lot of enemies. I better be getting a shit ton of XP for that. What about you? Okay, yeah, you're not repeat quest. I was about to say, are you repeat quest too? That should take me all the way up there. Hmm. <laughs> okay. So it's not going, doesn't seem like it's going to be much. But then again, that's just a talking quest. Let's, let's keep going and see if we can, uh, get anything out of it. I also got to remember that there are actual, like, overworld rewards, too. I should need to keep an eye on the market. Get a hammer or a staff or a relic if it's in my area. Nope, can't use that. There are no new staffs in there either. Noted. Magic attack and defense. Huh. But honestly, I like the server so far. It's pretty chilled, active. Not too bad. Especially if you want difficulty. If you actually want difficulty, this is the best server for that, for like anybody who's looking for that difficulty. Oh god, this is a collection quest. I totally forgot about this. I remember this quest all too well now. Because this is an area where I farm a certain... I think, tome. 
I think this is where I farm my tome. I was not happy about it. I wonder if the tome still exists on these guys. PTSD off of these enemies. That's all I can tell you. But I am looking forward to seeing Drifter like reworked because Drifter was actually pretty pretty cool. I especially like the the puppet side of it. So I'm very interested to see what they do with that. I never got the chance to play the Reaper version of it. Or Void Runner version of it. I say, did the sprite bug out? I think he did. I just want to see how much XP it gives. Hmm. Oh, my XPs are, are still up. Okay, I was just making sure I had my uh, charms up. They're still up. It's not giving too much right now. Is that because time five isn't on? How long does time five need actually last? I actually did not check that. I never checked to see how long that buff actually goes. Oh god, she got in the way. Okay, so which one am I after now? Oh, I'm after the yellow fish now. Huh. Well, there's another thing I was thinking of doing. I'll go to that to the next private server while also leveling up here and doing an occasional video of me catching up towards in game. That's also, not, that's also another thing I was planning on doing. Oh my god, this same plant has, still has the collision of a god. It, this invisible wall is so OP on that thing. <laughs> Forgot that was a freaking thing. Okay. 
health is good? No. <laughs> that XP is fucking awful. Goddamn. Oh, picked up a new talent. Huh? Oh, okay. Just confused the hell out of me. Why don't you? Oof, these quests are so long. Hmm. This is going to be a quite a long journey. <laughs> Ooh, it, it's almost time for me to start doing my uh, game stuff again. I'm going to call it there. This is going to be a short video. Probably going to be shorter videos until I can uh, actually get stuff done. So I'm probably going to combine everything. Kind of like jump cuts. That's probably what I'm going to do like per level. So <sighs> damn, that's that would be weird, though. Well, actually, I can't say that because Dragon Dogma 2 is coming up. Actually, so that's not too bad. So I guess I'll upload, like, every two or three, five levels, maybe? <laughs> it really depends. I don't know if I can catch, like, any other uh, XP events because... Uh, they normally they normally do it as soon as I go to work. That's the only downfall of this. Like as soon as they release it, it's always like after maintenance, directly after maintenance, and their maintenance is at a time that I just wake up and ready to go to work. <laughs> I'll figure out something. I will definitely figure out something. I say I'm not gonna try and keep brute forcing the dungeons. I will level <laughs> the normal way. It, you know, I'll just have music in the background listening to stuff. But more importantly, right now, I have to focus on my game and get everything situated for that before I can actually focus on this at the moment. So let me, you know, get everything situated for my game, get all of my uh, artists, my developer and everybody on their projects. Then I'll come back to this and start focusing on this more. At the moment, I just need to kind of put this over to the side. With that said, I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out.